Hi there. Happy Tuesday. My name is Matt Trusella, and I'm the executive pastor here at Desert Breeze. And I will be leading you through today's DV devotional. For a devotional, we'll be continuing to read some of Moses' final words before the Israelites journeyed into the Promised Land. But first, we're going to take time, just a minute, for a moment of silence and prayer. Take this moment to calm down, remove yourself, just for a second, from all the distractions of the day, and connect with your Lord. Ask the Holy Spirit to speak to you through this passage. Ask Him to lead you. Ask Him to give you something to take with you for the rest of the day. Let's do that now. Let's begin our devotional. First, we're going to read the scripture, listen, and if you have a Bible with you, feel free to read along. Deuteronomy 30, verse 19 and 20. I call heaven and earth to witness against you today that I have set forth before you life and death, blessing and curse. Therefore, choose life that you and your offspring may live, loving the Lord, obeying his voice, and holding fast to him. For he is your life and length of days, that you may dwell in the land that the Lord swore to your fathers, to Abraham, to Isaac, and to Jacob, to give to them. Now we're going to move to reflection. We will reread the same passage, but this time taking mental notes of anything that stands out to you. Again, if you have a Bible with you, read along once again and highlight any of those things. After the reading, Take a moment to ponder why those things stood out to you. Ask questions. Meditate. Let's read. I call heaven and earth to witness against you today that I have set forth before you life and death, blessing and curse. Therefore, choose life that you and your offspring may live, loving the Lord, obeying his voice, and holding fast to him. For he is your life and length of days that you may dwell in the land that the Lord swore to your fathers, to Abraham, to Isaac, and to Jacob, to give to them. Perfect. We're now going to move to response. Once again, we will reread the passage for a third time. Focus on those words and phrases that stood out to you. When this is finished, go to God in prayer. Talk to him about these words or phrases and ask him how you can apply these things to your day. Let's read. I call heaven and earth to witness against you today that I have set forth before you life and death, blessing and curse. Therefore, choose life that you and your offspring may live, loving the Lord, obeying his voice, and holding fast to him. For he is your life and length of days, that you may dwell in the land that the Lord swore to your fathers, to Abraham, to Isaac, and to Jacob, to give to them.
Good. We're now going to move to the final part of our devotional, rest. We will reread the passage one final time, and when we finish, use the silence to rest with God. Take what God has spoken to you through the scripture and pray it back to him. Let's read it one more time. I call heaven and earth to witness against you today that I have set forth before you life and death, blessing and curse. Therefore, choose life that you and your offspring may live, loving the Lord, obeying his voice, and holding fast to him. For he is your life and length of days, that you may dwell in the land that the Lord swore to your fathers, to Abraham, to Isaac, and to Jacob, to give to them.